So today I will be giving you five quick steps to start your day that will change your life in 21 days. All right. So this video is um, based on my uh, previous one, which is how to uh, be happy without taking drugs. Okay. If you haven't watched it, please do. So you have an overview of what we're talking about. And um, so we are focusing on the step one today. It's about self-love. So what is self-love? It's about investing time for yourself. It's giving time to know yourself more, to go deeper to your core, to connect with what you believe and your virtues. And um, yeah, so it's really giving the time to reflect and also to envision your visions, your visions in life, your purpose in life. So it's really about that. So, um, I'm going to give you the steps that I do, which is I um, learned it from the book of the monk who sold his Ferrari. What I first do is write, uh, I have written all my, my goals for a year in this book um, and clustered it into different categories. So first uh, category is about um, relationships. So what are my uh, dreams? Uh, in our in my relationship spiritual dreams physical dreams <laughs> mental dreams and financial dreams as well as professional and social dreams of course okay so i have clustered them and put them all in here so these are my goals for a year and um to uh, also make sure that it's smart also right so uh, it, it should be realistic otherwise i get pressured or i get um, stress and whatever um i wrote in here so um to to be able to um to, to stay clear and 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 um, help these uh to help myself to to stay focused in what i want to achieve i read these um what I write in here. So I read um, this one daily or, 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 or twice a week because I have broken it up to two months, right? So I take one uh, point in each category here and, and broken it up into the two monthly goals. So in the monthly goals, um, these are the the one that i prioritize that i want to achieve within within that certain month so they're all in here and and the reason why i i read them i read this every day or every other day so that i have a i have an overview in what i want to achieve within that week or within four weeks i could also also incorporate it in my work yeah so those are, that's the first step. And the second step is I read motivational books. So uh, whether it's scriptures, um, in this in this uh, motivational one is a daily, our daily journey. Um, it has scriptures inside and also reflections. So from there I get some encouraging thoughts or motivational thoughts from other people and will help, it helps my day to, to uh, be courageous, to, to stay positive. And uh, in the last video, I also mentioned um, that guarding our mind to, away from negative thoughts is very important. So we only, we, we don't let any negative thoughts stay in our mind because our mind is our garden and it should be bountiful. 
Okay, so that's two steps. And third step is I do yoga. So I do yoga for 30 minutes. Um, so yoga is very good in connecting your body and your soul on mind. So it's, it's, it's connecting, of course, it's like you have to be focused, you have to stay balanced, and it will help you get fit, okay? And then I, fourth step is meditation for t- 10 minutes. I do med- I meditate, I don't sleep <laughs> during the meditation. I try to envision what I want to achieve, my visions and even emotions that I want to, to be feeling in that day. I also visualize it and if I want to be happy, I want to picture myself happy. All right, so the last step is I make my breakfast. What I do for my breakfast, I create, I make smoothie and also um, make cereals. I will be showing all of you, all these to you, yoga, meditation, and also uh, how I make yoga in a short clip. All right, enjoy it and see ya. to make smoothie and cereals for breakfast so but before that i would like to introduce to you james wong james wong is an ethnobotanist so um he's uh, he has also a youtube channel he uh, he's um he he in this book he uh, read write a lot about the the food that you uh, the contains of the food what it is for our health and for example, um, all these uh, like berries, and uh, he also has some recipes and what it uh, what it gives you in your body. For uh, best example is the berries. Um, in this, it's showing here the 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 ranking like which fruit in the among the family that has mostly uh, um, the can prevent cancer or can prevent um, a heart disease or make your um, heart healthier or uh, can control your weight and, and your diabetes. Highly recommend you to do this book or to have this book at home. Yeah, you can buy it in Amazon. So, the, so we have here a lamp lettuce. Um, it's very common in Switzerland. It's very uh, it's high in it's it's like a family of um, spinach and carrots. We have here blueberries. So these are I will put them in the smoothie. So again, um, the book will guide you or help you to um, to get to know what you uh, eat and what you put in your breakfast. It's very important. Close it. So you have water until maximum. It's maximum. Smoothie. I'm gonna put it in the bowl. Into the bowl. So I'm gonna. Save the rest for my So I have added um, the rye flakes. This is a rye flakes. This is not oatmeal. Uh, this is rich in magnesium, folate, fiber. It's also antioxidant. It has, it's rich also in vitamin C and A. C and A, not C and A. So, uh, and next is um, I add uh, this is a uh, substitute or equivalent to chia seeds. 
is from the region or from Switzerland, it's local product. I also add it in the bowl. It's rich in protein and some other vitamins and minerals. I like also to add this kerbis, Kirne uh, is in German, uh, English it's uh, pumpkin seeds. It's rich in zinc and vitamin A. And here. And I like to add also then this moringa powder. Um, you can choose of course uh, whether to add it in your cereal or you want to add it uh, or you want to add it in your um, smoothie. Yeah, either way or okay. So there you go. So this is my green monotone breakfast no color. So, ready to eat. And then I will make some orange press. I will press some orange juice afterwards. So that's it. That's my breakfast. So, there you go. Um, those are the five steps that I recommend to you uh, to have um, to start your day and change your life in 21 days. So 21 days, because um, according to study, 21 days will help you build um, a new habit. So all you need to do is repeat it in 21 days and then it will be incorporated in your daily routine. So uh, yeah, um, for the book recommendation, uh, you may find the link down below um, for uh, uh, the book of um, James Wong and also uh, for the book of um, Robin Sharma. Sharma. All right. Um, see ya. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. Bye.